day two of Camp Rock. Before we begin today's activities, I would like to give a special thank you to Oklahoma 4-H and Oklahoma EPSCOR. Campers, are we ready to talk about geodes? Do you guys even know what geodes are? Well, geodes begin as bubbles in volcanic rock. Over a long time, millions of years to be exact, the outer shell of the spherical shape hardens and water containing silica precipitation forms on the inner walls of the hollow cavity within the geode. Campers, I would like for you to get the, jolly ran the bag with the Jolly Ranchers and the silicone mold out and your cocoa powder. You're going to need an adult for this part. You're going to separate your Jolly Ranchers. I gave you two of the same colors and two of the different colors. You are going to put them in the bag one at a time and you are going to break them up into, hard, or into little pieces just like so. I used two separate little baggies just so I didn't mix my colors. I put my two same colors in this bag and then my different colors in this one. Then you're going to smash those into little pieces. I used my red as my base color and then my two different colors, my green and blue, I put on the outer layer of my geode. Then you are going to preheat your oven to 300 degrees Fahrenheit. And as it preheats, you can do this part of the activity and dump it in your mold. Then you are going to place your mold onto your baking sheet and put it in the oven for three to four minutes. After your three to four minutes is up, you are going to take the cookie sheet out and take your silicone mold out. You can either leave it on the counter to let it harden, or if you don't want to wait that long like me, I place mine in the freezer for about 10 to 15 minutes. After your 10 to 15 minutes is up, you are going to pull away the silicone mold from your candy geode, and then you are going to take your cocoa powder and dip your geode like so in the cocoa powder, just roll it across, and there you have it you have a geode, your own candy geode. 